Today I'm going to talk to you about pruning an established shrub rose. This is a rose that has flowered for two or three summers. Pruning is one of the most important jobs to do in your garden. It gives the rose shape, structure and improves the blooms for the following summer. You'll need secateurs, gloves or gauntlets and a kneeling pad. As this is an established rose, you'll be pruning it down by about half. Find a strong stem in the centre of the plant, take it down by about half and use this as a guide for the rest of your stems. Don't worry too much about cutting off any buds or making slanted cuts. Once you've reduced the rose down by half, the next stage is to get rid of any dying, dead, diseased or damaged stems. As you can see here, these stems are much thinner than the others, less than a pencil thickness, so they should be removed as they won't hold the weight of a bloom. This also allows more air and light into the base of the plant. At this stage, you can remove any old foliage from the rose. Our pruning is now finished. To prevent disease spreading over into the next season, make sure you gather up all your old stems and foliage and pop them into your green waste or garden bin. 